so Eileen was in Spain and uh, sent me a message and was like, hey, are you interested in directing again? Let me shoot you a script. And I said, of course, please and thank you. Uh, read through it, loved it, and I cried while reading it and I laughed while reading it and I started visualizing it on stage and want like wanting to start dig into it and starting to work with it and I knew it was something that I really wanted to work on. Um, it is about two friends who have just graduated from high school and um, they've grown up their whole lives together being best friends and now things are st sort of starting to change. Uh, one of them's going off to college and one of their mothers has just committed suicide. So they are trying to contact her in a graveyard. Guy sniffed. They said, there she is, there's dinner. When I was writing this, it was sort of um, a response, I guess, to a lot of coming of age stories that I've seen mm -hmm. that um, claim to be like universal coming of age stories, which just doesn't make any sense because everyone's experience is super different, especially when coming to terms with sexuality and gender identity and that sort of thing. It's got blood. It's got sex. It's got drag. It's got a lot of feelings. <laughs> uh, but I think you'll leave it happy in a weird way because you'll feel like you experienced something that you wouldn't have on a normal day-to-day -day basis that's true yeah yeah it'll touch you in your heart and otherwise <laughs> <laughs>